I am number one, not number two If I'm not the one, I'm uncomfortable See the competition I've been running through Leveled up, I only see him in my rear view Switch! Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' I'm winning, get buckets from the court side to the nosebleeds Yeah, they love it I'm winning, get buckets from the first in and the last out, see me coming. First take, I'm hotter than hot, hotter than some boiling water, I bubble the pot. Team full of ballers, baby, we winning a lot. I'm like Curry with the rock when I get to my spot. I'm tapping in, I'm passionate, this is what passion is. This here, nah, this is no accident. From the start to the finish, I'm cashing in. I am number one, not number two If I'm not the one, I'm uncomfortable See the competition I've been running through Leveled up, I only see him in my rear view Okay, okay, okay First in and the last out Never tried to go the fast route Marathon, not a race Putting hours in, I cash out Game time, been lit Been the man, been him in the box like nine nine, got pinstripes on my skin. Okay, go mind by all in my zone. When the wind going home, hear it all in my tone. Work hard for this throne, you know I'm never lazy. Not the face, see me win, but those L's made me. Hear him talk, let him talk. All the ghosts have been called crazy. Lights on, I'm on. Lights on. I'm on, love the pressure, I can't let up, keep my head up, I can't let up You know I can't stand still, sticking to the plan still, no bots on my fans real, stay true on the man still Losses got you bent up, all that ain't go pent up, see you in my inbox, but everybody can't come I worked hard for this, put in hours, got scars from this, no sleep, I just lost and turn, thinking about how hard it get I've been chilling with my fam and them You've been chilling with a party. Nestled on the banks of the Hudson River, Mikey Stadium. It will play host to some of the nation's finest today and another thrilling edition of Army football. There's nothing quite like a great rivalry matchup in college football. The bitterness, the intensity, the lifetime of memories that will come as a result of what we're about to see in this one. As we'll see a team fresh and ready to go off of bye week, the Notre Dame Fighting Irish taking on a squad hoping to prevent another L this week, the Army Black Knights. For EA Sports College Football, Reese Davis with you alongside David Pollock and Jesse Palmer. Time to get this game started. He'll bring it back from inside his five. Just trucks through it. He was looking for some running room, but not much to be found as he stopped at the 18. So the Army Black Knights offense will take the first. Now let's see what they've got on second down. Still on his feet at the 45. Well, oh, we got loose. They are finding soft spots in this defense. He's got it down to the 25. Defense is going to have expecting man coverage that time. Third and long in field goal range. You're expecting it to be zone. Instead, they lock him up man to man. Everybody on an island. Everybody won. They get the incompletion now setting up fourth. They just had no rhythm in that last drive. So someone's going to have to step up and make a play, David, and get this thing going. Yeah, let's find some juice. Running the option. It's back. He has the first and still on his feet. Big play for this. Is that what I heard? I'm pretty sure that's what just happened. Listen, hasn't gone well. You've heard the outside noise continuing to get louder and louder. Haven't met expectations. And so all signs right now pointing to them potentially making that change. And he takes it in for the score. Touchdown, Army! First and goal. You 
know what's coming. They know what's coming. Can you stop it? And you can. Pound the football straight ahead. Get in for six. Nice job by the big fella. Just trying to find your rhythm. Some things work, some don't on that first drive, David. Be interesting to see what happens here on the second drive. Yeah, you got it. Has the sticks, and he may get more. On third and long, he'll need to loosen up that arm. And that'll be. Coming out on first down with the play fake. And the pressure was too much. They get him at the 15. Well, that's a great job on the blitz getting the sack. He's showing you his speed right there. And with that play, he's making some of the great Golden Domer linebackers of old proud. Guys like Manti Teo, Jalen Smith. How about Michael Stonebreak? One of the all-time great. The option look. He'll pull it on the read. Open space at the 25. Well, the Making you understand, like, I'm going to do this. I'm going to be patient. A lot of offenses aren't patient. They get too play, big play happy, wanting to force the ball down the field. Diagnose and go get it. They saw it, and they went and got it. They were not letting that ball go to the wide side of the field. Lines is back in the middle. First down, it's second and six. Oh, it's a reverse. Hard running there. He'll move it up to the spider. Tosses to the quarterback. Going up top. Oh, did he toast the coverage? Got it deep downfield. And the defense couldn't come out and he took it all away. Touchdown, Notre Dame! That is such a nice job by the receiver there. Play, acting like he's going to block and then getting downfield. He was wide open, thinking to himself, just don't drop this, just don't drop this. All he had to do was catch it and run it into the end zone. Well, and I think people underestimate the timing of a flea flicker, right? When you got to hand the football off, get the toss back, and the quarterback now be in sync with the receiver, and he catches it, you're right. At least they have the football in their hands every time. You know where they're going to be. You focus in, the defense locked it. And the quarterback is snowed under. The defense coming up big there, and the sack is great, but the secondary deserves some credit, too. No doubt. When you can cover like that in the secondary and drop back in your zone and only rush a few, and you feel comfortable getting home, and they're going to get to the quarterback, that is a great feeling, and that's fun to be. It changed too much, Reese. They had a great drive. They got the touchdown. Everything working. I would expect them to keep pushing this ball downhill. And just imagine if they could put another got the football early in this game to show you this is going to be more of the same, Palmer. Well, we talked to both coaching staff. Nothing but green ahead. And he ran away from the defense to take it in. Touchdown, Fighting Irish. This offense is so good. Man, they can hurt you in so many different ways. And they do it so quick, so explosive. They can put small drives together, big drives together. They've really had a great year. And that's why they're a top 10 offense. I think you can always look back and say, third and short, I'd love for you to run it, be the more physical team. But nice job sticking up and bowing their necks for this defense. A shot toward the end zone. The pass falls incomplete, and that's how we'll finish this half. First half in the books. Time now to join Kevin Connors in our halftime update. Fellas, what an environment there today. All the animosity and flat-out hatred that comes with a good old-fashioned rivalry game on display in that first half. And you know, in a day where the spread option and air raid are the offenses of choice, how nice is it to see the three yards and a cloud of dust approach? Although we've also seen some runs go for a lot longer. Physical offensive lines coupled with great backs is like a throwback to the olden days, and that's refreshing. That said, let's get back to the field and our guys in the booth to see who comes out. That pocket has been shaky, and if it continues to be that way in the second half, this could be a much different looking football game. He's got enough for the... They'll throw it on first down. Fires to the wide out. 
Finds space on the right. And stampeding through the defense. Big, big gain on that one as he steps out of bounds with a... You've got to be able to take advantage of him. This guy has the chance to play on Sundays. He's too good. If you've got a window to throw and that guy's out running a route, give him an opportunity. And there they go again with another huge gain on the ground. He's finally run out of bounds. Great execution by this offense. The running game coming through perfect fashion. Breaks the big run. Finishes inside the 10. When they're in short yardage situations or when they're in goal line situations, they just seem to play tougher. They just seem to play better. They've got guys that get after the football. And then they're setting up fourth down. It is true as he puts three on the board. And they'll push that lead out a little further. Already trailing big, and the clock is not their friend. They're bringing heat. Trying to escape and get it himself. They finally... Didn't happen that time, and the defense was able to get a negative play. They'll leave it with him. Turns it on in midfield. Ball is loose. Oh, possessions in the third, and desperately needing a score, they'll go for it on fourth down. He'll try to throw and pick up the first down. Looking left. Makes the grab, and he's got the first. Gets it into the end zone, but wait a minute. We'll have to check out the laundry on the field. Yeah, I think it's great to get points, but the great teams get touchdowns in the red area. you got to get out there this time and execute a little better on this drive. You're absolutely right, Dave. He's back to throw on second down. Trying to get to him. And the defense gets to the quarterback. Guys, we've come to the end of the quarter, and Notre Dame has the lead. Nice job by the defense there, getting a stop on the quarterback behind the line of scrimmage. We know they've been burned a few times early in this game. And the ball is intercepted. Didn't let him get loose on the return, but he'll take it as they have the ball at the 47. Nice job by this defense. That might be the exclamation point. Fourth quarter, I got a lead. You bring on the nickel defense. You know they're passing the football for plays just like that to make the INT and almost put this one away. Didn't go great. Now you're set up in an opportunity to get some points. Start thinking about what plays I like, Jesse, as I cross the field. There are a lot of offensive coordinators. That He's going to pass. It's complete to the right. resume and about to go to 10 and 1. Now they've got a little breathing room. They are in firm control of this game program next year. Yeah, and you want to see them finish strong, and I think Coach needs to finish strong. All the negativity swirling around the program, obviously, you hear it. It's a part of it. For the two-minute warning. Off play action. And they... It continues to tick, so let's see if they choose to keep the ball on the ground and stay conservative and run that clock. It's good. And now the lead is even bigger. From inside the 10, here he comes. He's got great speed. 
He stopped the return right there, and that will do it. This one is in the books. It's really easy to get caught up in the emotion of a rivalry game. We did, and certainly this was a huge win. Yeah, and you started, you circled it, you were ready for this team. This is this is the rivalry you put a lot of stock in all offseason. You're talking about this game in particular. You go out and get the dub. It's a relief because you definitely wanted this team. And it's bragging rights for everybody, for the coaching staff, for the fans, but how about for the players as well? For another 365 days, you can talk about how you went out, you dominated, and you beat your rival. A lot of these guys are going to go on to the NFL. They'll be in locker rooms next year. They'll be talking about this for a long time. So that's going to do it for us. For Jesse Palmer, David Pollock, I'm Reese Davis saying so long. This has been another presentation of EA Sports College Football.